The struck, the struck. They don't know about struck. When times get hard, they gon' teach you how to hustle. What's up with the gang? It's your boy, he wasn't still. Me back in this thing. Say, man, um, this is our last day. Man, days are really over. Ain't even no day. We're back in Miami. We're already at the dock. It's like 5 o'clock, 5.30 in the morning. We gotta go down and get declare our bottles, get our bottles. Uh, yeah, we still gotta wait till they let us off. They're not gonna let us off till about 8. 8 o'clock in the morning, I think. 8.30. 8.30. So we stuck right now on the ship just here. We need to go get our bottles. And we still got a little light day in Miami. So, this is another vlog. So, stay tuned. We're trying to get ready. Get all this stuff together. Take back the child. And we start moving around. Alright, gang, man. We is leaving the cruise ship. Y'all see you. It's a wrap for the cruise. Headed back to reality. Can't wait to get back home. Cause god damn it, I miss my bed. I miss my house. <laughs> I miss my cars. <laughs> I miss the barber shop. <laughs> I miss everything about home. <laughs> and we gotta sit at the airport for, for hours. For at least eight, let's see, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, ten, one, two, three, four, five, nine hours. Oh, shit. Nine hour wait, man. Thanks to baby, because she wants to tell a nigga late about the time we get off the ship. Well, you're welcome, baby. Thank you for this trip. Thank you for the trip, but thank you for the for the, the late flight too, baby. You're welcome, baby. Cause goddamn. You're welcome for it all, baby. Damn. <laughs> Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five. Damn. So long, it's about eight, 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 nine hours, man. We're gonna be waiting. We're sitting in the airport, man. You're laughing. You're laughing. I need you to. Uh, I will try to do First something else. Huh? First seat. Make it in the bag. Get him out the bag. Okay. Get him out the bag. Okay. All right, guy, man. I'm gonna tie back on child when we get out this. Out this uh, baggage place and what all that stuff and like that. Check back with y'all in a minute. Alright, gang, we, we done got off the ship. Had a long process of doing that. Now we in the Uber. Gonna head to this long wait at the hot at the uh, airport. You know, y'all see me counting this about eight, nine hours of wait. I wonder if we can actually do it if they, if they let us check our bags. Let's check our bags. In early. We can go, we can probably, you know, come back. I mean, find something to do. That's a long time sitting in the chairs. At that airport. It was uncomfortable. We're gonna be in the corner and shit. Curl up on the float.
all type of charges. Like he said, he said if you went to the top deck of the, of the ship, well, the top deck of the ship have their own cell phone towers. So as soon as you, if you go up there, <coughs> it's pinging and it's charging your phone. It's charging your account. But it didn't charge me. Well, we don't know because your account bill ain't came out yet. Ooh, I just paid my bill. Yes, for your next bill. You got to see if you had Roman charges. But it was doing me like that. It was doing me bad, you know. So they had, I had to work something out with them, man, to get my phone back on because my phone was blocked. Got off the ship, no phone, everything blocked. I bet people been trying to contact me and everything. No contact. It didn't even work with Wi-Fi.
content for the, for the, for the, for the channel. You know, I say it's always stuff to do in Miami. So that's where we headed. We headed to Miami Gardens right now. Guy, y'all see me over here. Trick Daddy spot. Yeah, I got the truck. I ain't got the truck already. So, yeah, we up here. Trick Daddy. Gonna get us some of the good old soul food. Yeah, you know. Got other shit in here. You got something else to do. For the time being. Sure you should do it. You sure I'm trying to get up in there. Like so, uh. It's like step back, man. Let go. But there's a line in this thing, boy. I see this. A line in this thing. So I'm gonna get this food. I'm taking back in the job. I see. All right, gang. We just still sitting out here waiting on this food. Man, it look like he probably make a lot of money off the uh, off of uh, the tourists and people that's coming in coming in and uh for off the boat and off the ship and stuff like that because we just seen a lot of people that's off the ship up here in line you know pulling up trying to get that Sundays you know? so it's pretty good pretty good spot pretty good location you know got my one of my favorite places over there check it Since cars have been sitting and they've been cranked a couple days. What I mean that's gonna be. I need to have a lighter for me. But yeah, man, uh, when we get this food, man, I'm gonna tap back good with y'all, man. You know. We right now posted. You see, we posted. We posted up. Posted. When we figure it out, I'm gonna let you know. Alright, gang, we got the food. Show y'all a little bit of it. I really don't wanna open the bag up like that, but Cause we gotta go back to the airport and chill out. That's the only thing we can do. Oh god damn. And it is a lot of fucking sugar in there. And the Kool-Aid. It tastes like Kool-Aid. Yeah. I don't know why they say it's blue. It's lemonade, yeah. blue lemonade, but it tastes like Kool-Aid. Oh, this is what the fish look like, y'all. Ooh wait. Oh, y'all make one and cheese look good. I know y'all don't like the sugar. Don't give me some. Did you add? Did you want? Did you? Did you, you didn't want mac and cheese? What I you get? I need some mac and cheese. Right. 
You see how she just wants some of my stuff and didn't even want none on her plate. Baby, I always want some of your stuff. She didn't even want no mac and cheese on her plate, but she wanted off my plate. Because he know I always be asking for stuff. He know. Hey. Better for playing. He knows. Hey. 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 This is not a shirt play. Everything he get, I want him to share. This is not a shirt play. <laughs> She's trying to make me sure. <laughs> nah. I hope it's nasty. Hope you, I, hope, I hope all your shit nasty. I hope they got no season, you know. Don't share. Blue. It's pretty good. So, we still sitting out here in front of the place. Waiting on our, our uh, Uber. Four minutes. So we can go on head back to the airport. So now we're down to four hours. So that's pretty good. That's better than nine. It's way better than nine. So we're down to four hours now before we get out of Miami. Headed back to Dallas. So man, I guess we're gonna tap back in with y'all when we make it to the airport and actually give y'all a little good food review once we take, taste the food. We'll give y'all a good food review. But right now we can't really do it to give me a food review because I wanna uh, be sitting down and, and doing my shit, you know, eating my shit, sitting down comfortably. So that's what we're gonna have to do. And we gotta go to this airport waiting in long lines just to get in through the through, through all this bullshit, you know. So when we get all through that, tap back in with y'all in a minute. Y'all see how we been riding, man? You know, luxury. Blacked out, tinted out. Guess you be pulling up like the president. Always. Yeah, always. always. You know. You ain't pulling up presidential out of town, man. You know what, what you doing? Alright, y'all, we headed back to the, um, the airport. Using the left two lanes to the left on Northwest 27th Avenue. Gang, we done made it into the airport. Man, say, man, every time we go through checkpoint or some shit like that, bro, it's always a problem. I ain't gonna lie, bro, it's always a problem, man, when we go through the checkpoint. Go, we done bought some bottles off the ship, get all the way up here. They say we put, they say we can take them on our carry on. Then they tell us we can't take the damn bottles on the plane. Like, goddamn. They, they, they took body spray. Like, we came here with that shit. That's what's crazy to me. Like, we came here with that. Nigga, we didn't buy that here. Nigga, we didn't buy that in Miami. We came from Texas with that. They're not the drinks. They could have said, they could have told us on the, on, on the boat that you cannot take it on the plane. It needs to be in your carrier. It needs to be in your bag that goes under the plane. But hopefully they don't break our bottles and baggage check. Hopefully everything is good. Oh, they don't just chunk a nigga shit off in there and shit. Respect the nigga shit. We ain't even got to eat our food yet. Man, say they made us drink all our drinks, our Kool-Aid. Man, I'm I'm frustrated. I ain't had a blunt. Ain't had nothing. And what's crazy, as we going through check-in, a nigga had a bag of Zai on the ground. Literally. And a pretty little bag, too. You know what I'm saying? So I know it had to be some gas in that motherfucking bag. It's pretty that bag one. Okay. <laughs> Man. <laughs> no, it had to be some Zai in that motherfucker. But shit. I damn me, uh, but yeah, man, we finna, uh, we finna goddamn me head to the, this uh, to, to where we sitting at. We still don't leave until five. And right now it's 132. So we got literally three hours. Four hours. About four hours. 
you. So when we get to where we going, we walking right now. So when we get to where we at, man, we're gonna type back in with you, man. Let's give y'all at least give y'all a little food review on the food. But man, this motherfucking airport, boy. Fucking 9-11, man. 9-11 made it hard for niggas to get on this plane and shit. For real. I'm gonna tap back in a minute. Alright gang, we're gonna do a food review. Give y'all a little taste. It's really kind of cold though. Everything that we done did, we was, hey, man, we had turned up in Miami. For sure. Hey, yeah, man, I'm finna end this vlog. We gotta get the bags. We gotta get the ride to the house, you know. Going with our day for the day. 
Okay. Baggage claim is still up. Uh huh. Crazy the ass beer bag claim is outside. But yeah, man. <laughs> Make sure y'all like, subscribe if y'all new to the channel, man. Make sure y'all hit that uh, notification bell, join the Boss Lifestyle Gang. Y'all know what it is. Hey, I'm out of the thing. When times get hard, they gon' teach you how to hustle. The struggle, the struggle. They don't know about struggle.